Okay, so let me show you inside Video Motion Pro. Now, as you can see, we have a really easy to use user interface to make video editing and creation super simple for everyone to do. So what I'm gonna do first of all is import some media directly for this project. So I'm gonna grab this one here, this video footage, and also an audio backing track for my video. Okay, so on the left hand side, once you've created your videos, you can also upload your videos directly onto YouTube from within the software. Just simply sign into your account and add your title, your tags, description, and upload the video to YouTube. It also comes with screen recording, so you can create demonstration videos just like I'm doing right now. You can create videos for video training courses, tutorial videos, and you can sell your video content on sites like Udemy, Skillfeed, and Skillshare as well as you can package your videos up into an info product and sell them on sites like JVZoo, ClickBank, or the Warrior Forum. Now it also comes with webcam recording, so you can record videos directly like you're on camera from your computer with the webcam recorder. So what I'm gonna do first of all is actually create a logo animation for the introduction of our video to really make it look professional and brand my video. So if I click on add intro, you can see that we've got a whole bunch of awesome animated introduction templates, like so. And what I'm gonna do now is grab this geometric logo one, and I'm just gonna change up the text. And I'm gonna add my logo. And you have to see in just a second, we've got an awesome animated intro for our video. So I'm gonna add this intro. Okay, great. So now what I'm gonna do is actually grab some of that media footage that I imported, and I'm just gonna drag it onto the timeline. And I'm just gonna make it cut after about five seconds. I just want about five seconds of this playing on the timeline. Okay, and I'm just gonna bring these back together and drag this out like so. And then what I'm gonna do is grab this ink drop one as well and grab it, drag it onto the timeline. And I'm just gonna cut this as well, just after five seconds about there, I guess. Drag it a little bit and then select it and click cut. And I'll bring these back together and just drag this out like so. Okay, cool. So now what I'm gonna do is add on actually a lower third animation by clicking on lower thirds and add lower third. And lower thirds are basically animations which go across the lower third of your screen. And they really brand your videos and make them look really professional. We've got a whole bunch of animated ones here. You can just add your name, your website details and really brand your videos professionally. So I'm gonna grab this one here and type in my name here, and I'll type in Video Motion Pro as well. And I'm just gonna grab my logo for this one as well. As you can see, we've got an awesome animation, so I'm gonna add this lower third to my project as well. Okay, so as you can see, we've got an awesome lower third here, and if I play this through, you can see it's animated, and it goes on like so, and then it animates out as well from the screen like that. All right, so now what I'm gonna do is add on an outro animation slide to my video to get more views and subscribers to my YouTube channel and actually generate more traffic back to my website as well using these slides where you can add on your website details and videos to get more views to your channel. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is actually import some videos and then add them onto the slide. Okay, so as you can see, I've added on the videos for this video slide, and I'm just gonna go ahead and change up the text. Okay, great, so now what I can do is simply add that outro to the end of my video project. Okay, cool, so as you can see, we've created this outro slide, and these are perfect, you know, for adding on clickable links within YouTube to get more views to your other videos on your channel, as well as get subscribers by having a call to action button like this. Now, what I'm gonna do finally is add on an audio track, to this video and then I'm gonna go ahead and render this as a video. So I'm just gonna zoom out here and I'll just cut off the end of this audio track. And I'll bring these back together like that. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is click on render and I'm gonna create this into a video project and show you exactly what we just created.
With Video Motion Pro, you can also create stunning green screen videos where you can remove the green and add in a background image or a video to have an awesome looking green screen video. Now this is perfect for creating on-camera videos where you shoot with the green screen in the background and uh, really professionalize your videos by removing the green. So what I'm gonna do is simply select this image here and drag it out and I'm gonna remove the green from this green screen video by clicking on the green screen tab and I'm gonna bring up the softness to about 16 or so and click on apply color. Now it's that simple to create green screen videos. I'm just gonna mute this audio and then show you a quick preview. 